Hello and welcome. I'm Lizzie, a software engineer at DataLogix, and today I'll be showing you how to try out a PDFL using our NuGet package. So let's get started. First off, we're going to go to our GitHub page, which we have a convenient link to on our website. Then we're going to go to Adobe PDF Library Samples and clone that down using Git. Once that's done, we're going to open it up using Visual Studios 2022. And the reason that's important is uh, our NuGet package uses is in .NET 6. Alright, and we're specifically going to show off our optical character recognition sample. Um, we have plenty of other samples for you guys to try out and play with. Alright, let's get that open. All right. And we're specifically going to show off our optical character recognition sample where we are adding text to an image. And the reason this could be useful is you might have a scanned image of a document, but you can't actually interact with that information at all. Um, for example, uh, this is actually the image that will be used in the sample we're showing off. We've got some text at the top you can select, but when you try to select over the image, you can't interact with that text. Um, similar for searching, you can search the text that is actually text, but you will not be able to interact with that um, image text, despite that word being in the first line of that image. Alright, so we'll get back to the sample. We should be able to view the code now that it's finished loading. Alright, and in our sample inputs location, which is also a folder in that repository we pulled down, We've got that image that I showed off and placed in that example PDF, and this should just run right out of the, PDF, right out of the box. Um, and it will take a bit the first time you run it because it's activating the license. And you'll have a 30-day license key, which should give you plenty of time to try it out, see if this meets your needs. We've got plenty of other samples for you to try out, do some plug and play, and hopefully find what you're looking for. All right, so now that's done. Uh, let me show you where you can find your output file. Um, so here's the repository we cloned down. Uh, .NET, sample source, optical character recognition, add image to PDF, bin, debug, net6. Um, and the reason it puts it here is this is where Visual Studios is defaulting to put the exe it built. And currently the sample is written to put its output file just right next to that executable. So we'll open that up. And now you'll actually be able to interact with that text now that the OSRR has been ran over it. So now we can copy that, just play and paste that text wherever we want, whether it's notepad file, whatever. And you will also have the ability to search it now as if it had text all along. All right, hope that helps.